Hello everyone, I'm Social Democrat Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Kaiserreich. So, last time, we took out Hunan and integrated them. Well, not we really didn't integrate them, but they're now part of our country. Good old part of Hunan, this area. Yeah, cool. So, last time, we tried to get Maklik to join us, but, uh, well, they said nah. And I don't like the word nah, so we're going to have to take them out. So, ooh, continue army reforms. Absolutely. Cool. I could do war propaganda against communist France, but let me just, I guess, talk about the focuses and the direction of China. No matter what decision I'm going to choose, or uh, that I do choose, it's going to make some people upset. So, I am in a no-win position, because if I go down Dai's coup, people will be upset. If I go down continue tutelage, people is going to be upset. Local democratic government, people is going to be upset. So, what I choose is whatever I will choose. I'm honestly not really sure what I'm going to choose. But I know I need some tanks. That's what I need to know. And let's see. Well, just let's double check. So I could go totalist. Make it the PRC. We get a general. Totalism. Daily po political power gain. More totalism. Stability. Switch to a closed econ economy. Um, eh, that's okay. Continue tutelage, though. Gives us more daily political power. Same amount. Ooh, we're oh, wait. Yeah, reply from the Maklik. The mob branch of the KMT has refused our order, and they will regret this since they are considerably weaker than our government. Nevertheless, they will pay in blood for the betrayal. It is a shame it came to this, though. We can accept this condition, then. Our local democratic government. So, more division defense on core territory. Legalize pro-revolution parties. We get more attack on core territory and war support. Consultative conference, which doesn't look terrible. First national elections. Well... Probably going to choose recognize urban syndicalists, but I'll probably repay the syndicalists just because they did help us. Pivot towards Washington. I had a subscriber tell me that it's actually don't I should not ally the Entente really just because, uh, yeah they were really they made they gave us a century of humiliation the Entente the British monarchy so that actually makes a lot of sense for me to not work with the Entente. They can go die. And if I try to help out the American Union state now, oops, well. It's a little too late. So, oh yeah, and I'm also fighting in Spain. Forgot about that. Forgot that we were involved in the Spanish conflict. And it doesn't really look like we're winning at all. It's pretty laggy. Pretty normal. Vincent Orojo Uh, We are currently winning. That's for another four... Ah, another four days? Never did go up a little bit. But, regardless, we must go to war with... These guys. Ooh, Hui Brigades. Nice. Chinese Muslims. Ooh. A little bit more manpower. And nav National Revolutionary Army gets more cavalry attack and defense. Um, sure. Why not? We'll take it, even though I'm not really going to use cavalry. And actually, we're still producing a lot of divisions, which is nice. Still have a big deficit of artillery and guns and support equipment, which isn't nice. But, regardless, we still have to go to war anyways. This group lost quite a few guys. Holy cow. You all... Yeah. Give us some okayish XP. They're getting some air XP still. Not a lot, not a lot, but still some. About 900,000 manpower. I will go eventually and core some of this territory, but I will need more political power. Ooh, free civilian factories. I always want to make at least one run of civilian fact... Wait, what? Wait, what? They said no. I thought they refused. Mmm... Uh, Okay, I was preparing to go to war, but okay, sure, yeah, 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 no, no problems here, absolutely no problemo, awesome, that is awesome, yeah, I I'm not really sure what else to say, but awesome, Mongolia, what are you doing now, you're independent, you are independent as well as, t oh my goodness, left KMT, they're all independent, independent, they're not going to be that independent for too long. Uh, I'm probably going to take out Mongolia first, just because I have a huge border with them. And it might be easier for me to kill them off first. Ah. Oh, cancel non-aggression pact, I see, huh? I see what you really are like, then. Oh! Look at those guns. Look at that our infantry equipment. I need more support equipment. Holy cow. Oh, my goodness. We need more civilian factories, so I can trade for more of this stuff. Well, I'll trade with Hungary. Sounds good to me. Nice. 
Why? You know, you can't trust the Entente. You just can't trust them. Why do they want to cancel a non-aggression pact? I've got no beef with you. But you know what? If you want to have beef, you better be ready to eat. Because I will make sure we will win. Parte Commune. Save up that political power just a wee bit. And... Oh, the Kamul... Oh, wait. Kamul Khanate. We get... After two weeks, Annex War go against the Kamul Khanate. Hmm... It's not bad. Can I go to war with Mong... Oh, hold on. With Mongolia. Retake Outer Mongolia. March on Outer Mongolia. What I might do right now, though... We're not, we don't have a big board with these guys. Let's take out the Kamula Khanate, if possible. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Let's do that. You guys, come over here. Take them out when we can. Lin, do you have anything for us? No. And I'm neglecting my soldiers in Spain. Oh, well. They have a lot of manpower. All right. You guys have way less, which is kind of good. So, fighting for Xinjiang. Cool, have you guys replenished your strength? It looks like you guys have. What if you try to help out? Could you win? You don't have air superiority, huh? Well, that's interesting. Yeah, you really don't. Holy cow. If that's the case. Come over here. Help them out. You still get green over here, which is nice. But, uh... You're still doing some damage over here, which is good. That should help us win here. Emphasis on should... We have over 412 people in our country that's not part of our core population. That's insane. Alright, so let's go ahead and convert you to that. Convert you to that. Good, good, good. Military factories. Stuff is still going on. I love it. What else, do we, what else can we put in here? Ooh, land use stacks. Nice. 30%, 3, 4, 1, 2. There's a lot of 2s. There's not a lot of 3s. 2s. Oh, there's a 3. There you go. There you go. And then build up some military factories there when you're done. Good. Next up, retake Outer Mongolia. Mongolia has been a haven for banditry and hostile nationalism for untold generations. Given the threat they pose to our stability, many generals and politicians are calling for the second northern expedition to be expanded to include the reintegration of Outer Mongolia as well. Absolutely. Well, you guys are not looking too good right now since I greatly expanded our borders here. Ooh. Go up to 18. That'll be good. Uh, you're suffering from attrition, which I really hate. Do that. Thank you. You're looking kind of okay. Uh, against East Turkestan and get an Annex War Goal? Yeah, why not? You guys will just go right on in and storm them. And thank you very much. Take them out, please. Oh, oh we're winning here already. 10 divisions versus 4. Not bad. Not bad pretty at all. Oh, you want a non-aggression effect? Nope. Oh, wait. Oh, but my soldiers are coming back from Spain. Ah, the Kingdom of Spain should be able to win this one. They should be able to win. Should be. Oh, you guys are not looking good right there. Hmm. Canada's looking pretty good over here. Oh, look. We're winning. I love it. Losses. Not bad. Good. 40,000 more dead over there. The fall of Burgos. Nice. Can the Carlos hope to come back from this? Versus a quarter million. Holy cow. A quarter million? That's so many people that live here. How did you kill that many people off? A quarter million? Oh my goodness. Holy cow. Nationalize. I do want to integrate people in time. In time. Alright. 300 losses. We've done 16,000 losses to them. Great, great, great. And then we will soon have these guys done as well. Oh, good. They're back. They'll, they won't be sent back anytime soon, though. 22 divisions. They got a lot of manpower. They don't have a lot of strength per division, though, which is good. I could make some motorized, but that doesn't really help us too much. Do I have some cavalry? No, I don't. That's okay. We can get rid of that. You all... What is our doctrine like? It's still reformed. Or reforming, I should say. That's okay. Keep producing stuff. Awesome. I'm completely ignoring the navy, but whatever. Whatever.
Good, keep going north, guys. Keep going north. They probably don't have enough guns to guard their lines. Looking great. Russia announces her ambitions. Many still view Russia as a failed state, but... It'll be interesting to see what they do. The Caucasus direction. Finally, they're going down the Caucasus direction. There's a lot of war going on. I love it. Oh, poor Huey Long. Poor, poor Huey Long. Oh, what's going Oh, my goodness. The Entente's getting walloped in South America. Oh, see? The I knew it. They Why would... Deal with the devil? Oh, no. I thought it was the Pacific States and the USA. They signed a non-aggression pact. Or, no, they signed a peace conference. That's interesting. That's really quite interesting to see that. But Huey Long is still probably going to get defeated. Oh, well. Oh, are you not winning here? No, no, no. That's, that's illegal. You, you can't lose. No, you can't lose there. What are you talking about? Lost how many thousands? A thousand. Versus 45,000. And we'd get all the way to Dihua. And I'll send my soldiers down this way, which is going to take quite a while. Well, that's okay. We can go to war with Mongolia in the meantime, probably. National Revolutionary Army. Good. Land use tax. When I see this national spirit, I immediately get a little worried. Because if you play vanilla with Waking the Tiger, this isn't always a good sign. So. Plurality, popular support. Yes. Absolutely. Wow, we have no support for syndicalists. But 12, almost 13% support for totalism, though. Totalism. Good. Come on, sons. Come on. Doing a great job. you level 6. He's almost a trickster. He's becoming a hills fighter. Good. Does Lee have anything here? No. Do you have anything here? Do you have anything here? No. Get another division? Throw you right here. We are going to need some more infrastructure. Yeah, build that up. Definitely build it up. Ah, retake out of Mongolia. Good. Next up, I could do pay the legation cities. I'll probably do repay the syndicalists. They really do deserve my help. Kind of. Well, Kami in France doesn't. They actually didn't help me that much, to be frank with you. Bharatiya did, though. Mission to Red India did. So I definitely... Wait, a diplomatic mission. Yeah, this. these are the guys I want to help out, so... Chinese Expeditionary Force. Hmm. What do I want to do? It's not bad. Foreign research partner stuff. Tax opium trade. Prohibit opium. Growing popular support. Lose daily political power, but get more consumers' goods. Hmm. Social democracy. Do we believe in drugs? Integrate coastal concessions. As core states cost five less political power. Um, National Reconstruction Commission decisions. Well... Let's see. Dare to Die Corps. Um, uh, I don't want to tax the opium. I want to prohibit opium. But this hurts our factories. Whatever, we'll do this anyway. Opium has been the scourge of China since the beginning of the century of humiliation, which we don't want to get rid of. And vast swaths of Southeast China suffer from endemic opiate addiction. As a matter of national security and pride, we must not just eradicate opium production, but also crack down on its trade and possession within controlled territories. It's going to hurt our production. But it's a necessary evil. Offer Mongolia protection under the KMT. Or autonomy. Demands submission. Offers autonomy. If they agree, we'll get the following effects and they become our puppet. Do I want them as a puppet? Oh, hold on. We can march on Mongolia. It's a one China policy, you know. It's a single China. Yeah, this, it's got to happen this way. Yeah, autonomy. <clears throat> yeah, what? autonomy. What? <sighs> come on, come on. I might not be playing totalist, but let's be real here. I mean, our guys are doing really well. We even took their little capital city. Uh oh, he even got another upgrade. Is he a trickster yet? He is a trickster! Move faster, my friend. Move faster. And now we gotta get all the way up to there. Oh my goodness. Oh, maybe not. They're literally 99% of the way there, and we've killed off a total of 64,000 of these guys. Not bad. 
Come on, come on, come on. Good, another division, mechanized offensives. We are still working on land doctrines, I realize. Shock and awe, thank you. Next up, industrialize. I do want to integrate some more provinces, though. Uh, opioid production, good. Got a new deal, which I do want to do next as well. High popular support, that looks pretty good. Come on. Oh, then you got some more upgrades, maybe? No? Okay. How about you? There you go. <clears throat> oh, they are not that big. Well, I'll definitely take this area if I can. Definitely don't want to fight up there. There you go. It's going to be ugly to fight against, but so be it. But, sh oh, shit. Nikes. We got cut off. Well, that's not cool. You know what? I'm going to get my guys out of here as fast as possible, and then we'll go straight to war with these guys. Because they said no to my divisions. No one says no to my divisions. No one does. Come on, get out of there really quickly. How many divisions do they have? Six or seven. They'll be easy to smash, probably. You stay there. You stay there. Hold, hold, hold. Get some more... I don't think we can even get him supply here. There's <clears throat> no victory points. Oh my god. Seriously? Come on, hurry up, fellas. You guys, very nice. Another full army. We have a war goal against Mongolia? Yes, we do. Awesome. Just march straight on in. They shouldn't be too much of a problem to deal with. Shouldn't be. And if we can get that tile, we can actually send supplies through here, so that's good. Two thousand losses versus a hundred. Four thousand losses versus three hundred. Not bad. Not bad. Canada's still struggling. Italy's really struggling. Spain is struggling a little bit. Uh, the American Union state. Hmm. Could I start some Lemleys to you or something? I, don't have, I really don't have very much of anything, actually. Yeah, I'm out of guns again. Whoops. Sounds like more military factories will be needed. In time, in time. Another army? Absolutely. Under Sun Liren. Good. Hey, you got supplies. Good. You guys are doing great. You guys are getting down there. Get out of their lands. Come on. Hurry up so I can actually go to war with these guys. Three, two, one. Oh my god, you take so long. There you go. Kill them off. Destroy them for the fake heretics they are. Even though I don't think they're really heretics. They're just fake Chinese. Fake Chinese government. Not bad. We're looking more and more whole as the day goes by. Or the, as the months or weeks go by. Um, revolutionize some places. Continue army reform. Not bad. Industrialize. I could industrialize more. It doesn't give us that much. Maybe a factory or two? Maybe two factories? Just one? It's not really worth it too much. Ah, uh, let's go and integrate a province. Not Qinghai. How about Shangxi? Shangxi or Shangxi? Can I do something else here? Not really. Let's do Shangxi. Because why not? Good. Very good. Come on down here, guys. Ah, plane. A 1940s plane. Thank God. Uh, attack bombers? Sure, I'll take some attack bombers. Cover yourselves a little bit better than that. Alright, well. Russia, good luck. Wait, how do you touch Georgia? What the heck? That's interesting, to say the least. Yeah, I wasn't ready for this. Good, better planes. Awesome! 
Opium Prohibition, which really is factories, whatever. And then the Ganon New Deal. There are proposals within the Min Kwan faction to turn Ganon province into a model region for the future Chinese development. Social programs such as state orphanages, free clinics and schools, and public housing may show to the world that even in the most remote regions of a war-torn China, the nationalists are dedicated to improving the quality of life for all citizens. Stability, war support, infrastructure, good stuff. Yeah, the Don Kaban Union is dead. Holy cow. And we need more civilian factories. Of course. There you go. Keep making that stuff. That's important. That's very, very important. Now we're not winning as well down here. God dang it. Uh, hold on. The only reason why we're not winning is because people aren't are choosing to not go. Maybe I should do this a little bit better. There you go. Now you should be able to win. Okay, so they're still choosing to not go. The AI is very odd in this game, I swear to God. Yeah, no. Keep them busy, keep them busy. Why are you not going? Just go up here. That makes no sense. Alright, guys. Ethiopia declared war in Somalia. Watch out, they're all killing each other in Africa now. Good, good, good. More divisions? Nope. Type 34 is Yao. Type 36. Thank you. Good, good, good. Hotan? Sure, sure. Very nice. I did choose to fight in some of the most remote regions of China, so... Yeah, it's going to take a while to kill these guys off. Yeah. That's okay, though. That's okay. But I'm loving that army XP. Loving it. How many of our losses so far? 10,000 versus 40,000? Not bad. Not bad. We got a good amount of Coast Guards. We got two extra divisions here. Boobings. I mean, I'll convert you to Powell Bing Zen. Oh, we need more artillery too. Holy cow. Oh, wait. Yeah, you guys were the guys I sent over. That's okay. We don't need them for now. Yeah, we need more guns. We need a lot of things. We need a lot of things. Holy goodness. Trying to make China whole again is costly. That's okay. Mongolia shouldn't stand up for that much longer, though. Come on, son. Come on. Keep moving in. Good. You're doing great. Continue the army reforms? Absolutely. War propaganda? We don't really need that. Develop Guangdong? Sure. Why not? Good. Still attacking the capital. Love it. They want to attack us, and I shall attack them. Mongolia should fall relatively soon, but I guess not. Oh, goodness. We have got so much land to conquer. Should have used a bunch of cavalry to conquer Mongolia. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Encircle, destroy. Surprised there's no more divisions around here. I would. I, I'm a little surprised that they're not. Nice. <clears throat> so I do want to support the Bharatiya Commune. They are the only faction, or the only country, to have actually supported us in our extreme time of need. The fall of Rio de Janeiro. Ah, nice. Good. Federated syndicates of Bolivia. The American Union is still trying to hold on here for dear life. They're not doing so well, though. This is really disgusting. Nebraska and Kansas, though. Oof. Even Wisconsin's not looking good. Hmm. We don't want to be them. <clears throat> Come on, keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Smash them. Smash them without any guns. <laughs> the big turnaround. There you go. Look at how strong that division is. Oof. Come on, make sure there's no divisions in Kashgar. Oh my god, you walk so slowly. 
And we're almost there. Ghana New Deal. Great. Now let us choose... Restore Sovereignty over Tibet. Hmm. Hmm. I could do that. <clears throat> or we'll just recognize urban syndicalists. The support from syndicalists, be it aid from foreign states or local groups, rising up to stand up for their rights, was vital in securing our revolution. In light of this, we should allow them to have a greater voice in the organization of labor as well. Yeah, I know. Happy 1941 to everyone. I know I can't make everyone happy, but it is what it is. I make everyone either unhappy or no one gets happiness. Well, actually, yeah, that is the same result. Thank you for your bodies. I love your bodies. Cool. Now I can attack Tibet from this side. I was going to kill off my supply of guns, though. Actually, how many divisions? You're led by a child. The 14th Dalai Lama. Three aristocracy resettled. I almost forgot that Tibet has its own focus tree. Wild. Limited Tibetan intervention. Dobbs. Dob Dobbs. Recruitment. Hmm. Recovery teams. Dmag Cigar Supremacy. Interesting. We have a lot of guns, though. We got a ton of guns. It's not bad. Go 30, 25. Do that. That'll be fine. Artillery. Can always use more. We need actually some steel. That's not good. Steel. I, I want more civilian factories because, well, I, I love civilian factories. They're going to last us until, until the end of the game. So, let's go and grab one thing of steel. That's really, really important. Oh, don't want to help those guys. Ah, uh, I guess I'll help out the American Union State. They could use every little thing they could... Every little thing of help they can take. How strong are they? They're, the Federalists are... The Federals are really strong. Holy cow. Yeah, Huey Long, yeah, you, you're going to go bye-bye. I'd be very surprised if you win. Very surprised. But, you know, weird things have happened before. Alright, so we want to finish off to... That. I should have done that focus instead of this one. Oh well, we still have Mongolia to focus on here, so that's okay. Guns are good. Yeah, we got a small surplus of support equipment. We have a small, tiny surplus of tactical bombers. It's not bad. Nice. Yeah, I, I definitely need some tactical bomber support. Not bad. Iron Guard Romania joined the Reich's Pact. Ooh, that's interesting. Ah, uh, encryption. Awesome. And that's, uh, Nuclear China. Instead of construction or more industrial things, I have... Yeah, that's just the right way to go, you know. Just the right way to go. Good. Go down somewhere else. Let's put you in half. Uh, join him. I don't know. Whatever. Who cares? There you go. Oh, we got encircled. Huh. Good job, Mongolia. You actually encircled me. Six more divisions, though. Thank you. Not bad. Not bad. Keep it up, guys. You're almost there. Dekem Belder. God dang, it's pretty darn laggy now. Oh, good. More military factories. Thank you. I could have built it there, but whatever. Whatever. Um, how long does it take to me to integrate more provinces? Hey, the Picasso went down. Now to integrate normal Shangxi. Nice. We got like five more million core population. Love it. Okay, for a while I was surprised. Like, what are they doing? Why are they not dead yet? That's okay. Thank you very much. Now we have a big old border with Russia. Hmm. Not always a good thing. Reformed government of China. Well, what are you up to? They got a lot of manpower, a couple divisions. They have Asian Core Prosperity Sphere, which really helps them out. Buying, s oh my gosh, buying silver. Holy cow. Okay, Russia, well, not fun. Terrible legitimacy. Japanese Economic Union, Baojia System. Unification by subjugation. Yeah, no, towards Japan. Yeah, that's what we thought. Join the yen block. Yeah, uh-huh. Get some outsider help. Oh, what's going on? Hold on. Oh, the fate of... Oh, Mongol... What? No. Are you kidding me? 
Yeah. Liberate them? Hell no. Hell no. No, 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 no. You're crazy. Me and Mon my Mongolian bros? We won China. China plus Mongolia. Come on, man. Don't you lie to me saying that they should be independent. I don't care. Oh, come on. Hurry up. Finish this up, please. Actually, I'm at peace. I could help out Spain again. I could get maybe a few more things. Send volunteers. I can send three this time. Cool. There you go. I've got nothing else to do. I could send volunteers to other places, but... Whatever. I could probably get a lot of air XP if I sent guys this way. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Um... Do we long? I could send four divisions. Wow. I really don't... I kind of don't want to do it like this, just because... I'm not going to remember to, like, watch what Huey Long is doing, or, you know, what they're up to. But I kind of don't mind getting maybe some more air XP. I have some APCs, but oh my god, look how weak these guys are. Oh, they kind of deserve to lose. Uh, I can put 167, and then how many planes can I put here? 167. Planes I was using before, you going back to Spain, y'all were doing a great job. Awesome. And... Got a hundred of them fighters. There you go. Cool. Go to the deep south. Once you, of course, are deployed. Russia declared war on Azerbaijan. Only makes sense. This will probably destroy my fighter production. <clears throat> probably. Come on, do that. Vamanos, vamanos. 38... You can get up to 50, probably. That'd be fine. Cool. Very cool. Let's see what you can do about this area. We need more artillery. I need more planes. Recognize urban syndicalists. Awesome. And let's do restore sovereignty over Tibet. Neutralize Russian imperialism. Ooh. The provinces of Zaibi and Xinjiang have up until now been largely treated as personal fiefdoms by whichever warlords presently happen to be reigning over those lands. Bringing these provinces, provinces back into the fold should be a priority. Actually. Continue tutelage. Oh. Local democratic governments. Hmm. Hmm. These are okay. I mean... Continued tutelage gives me more uh, daily political power, which I like, but I'm not, I don't care much for ra uh, social liberalism. Radical socialism. It's okay. Hmm. Oh, there goes Georgia. Oh. Actually, Georgia held up for quite a while. Ah, hello there. How is the party going? Oh, you're led by nobody. By Dang. Hello, Dang. Awesome. And then you guys are going to probably die on the front lines. Nevertheless, grind up that XP. God against the evil imperialists. Evil American imperialists, please. Oh, you're even a defender. And you're an inflexible strategist. Can I put you under a field... Oh my gosh, we got so many field marshals here. More attack, less recovery rate. You sound perfect for the job. Actually, let's do Jin. He sounds pretty good. And then you guys will be under... Fawn? Fawn sounds like a good guy. Are you guys getting attacked? Or are you... You guys might be attacking. Hmm. A little troublesome. How much more army XP do we need? Oh, there it is. 100. Oh, we're getting... Oh, we're getting attacked over here. Oh, your strength isn't very high. That's not good. More air... More air XP. Yeah, baby. Yeah, buddy. Oh, the, the Germans quite literally... Oh, no, I thought they navally invaded over here, but they're still... They still have Belgium. Interesting. Alright, then. Uh, I really don't want to spend too much of this. How much support going... Eh, we don't have that much. Get some engineers. That's at le the very least something I need for my Coast Guard divisions. Yeah. Uh, you guys are not getting attacked. No wonder you're losing the war. You, all you do is attack. Oh, maybe it's over here. Try something like that. There you go. There you go. What are we building? Roads? Factories? Good stuff? I love it. 
How much further? Because I wanted to attack to bet before this episode's over. Oh, 5% support for syndicalists. Cool. Support equipment, artillery, the good stuff. The absolute good stuff. And I need to build up some refiners because we're losing a little bit of fuel. The, we barely have any fuel being made. Research slots. Good. Tactical bomber one we'll have. It's not really a good year for that, but whatever. Um, yeah, I definitely need more divisions on this front line here. Holy cow. Happy 1941, everyone. Industry. Construction speed. I'm going to immediately go for construction so I can build things up faster and better. Good. Do that. Army. Holy cow. 150 more. The army reform is completed. That'd be great to do. Okay, Venezuela. Okay. What are you up to? You pissed everyone off. Or all the Entente members off. That's interesting. Come on. Oh. Mm, it's probably not worth fighting these guys over here. It's gonna hold for now. Wait for them to attack us, really. I mean, they're gonna attack us repeatedly. Good amount of time. Good time to get some army XP until we go to war with Tibet, really. Can I have four divisions here? Oh, you got, you're busy down in Jackson. Well, hope, enjoy the heat for now, because when you get sent back, you might not. Oh. Oh, there's quite a bit of lag. Go ahead and help try to hold. That's okay. You're here to learn. I mean, let's be real. The manpower is replaceable. It's absolutely replaceable. The guns? Eh, they're pretty replaceable as well. Not bad. Oh, Spain really needed me to show up again. Holy cow. Oh, nice. And a tiny, tiny encirclement. Supplies looking pretty good. I need more tactical bombers, though. Pretty normal. Pretty normal stuff. I need more steel. Need more factories in general. Oh my goodness, radio. Uh, it'd be a sin if I didn't have radio near Beijing. Or there. Or there. Or here. Or even there. Or there. Or there. Eh, maybe not there. Or here. Oh, come on, man. I'll try to help you. I really do. But that's what you do to me? I'm not giving anything to Russia. No. German Empire? No. Oh yeah, Bartia Commune. Good people. Good, good people. Next up, Siam. Can't really complain against them. Good people. Nice. Yeah, this will help everything out quite nicely. Cool, you guys got attacked pretty darn hard around here. Pretty darn hard. If you attacked here, could you win? Yeah, with enough air support, you can. I want to help at least kill off one Spanish faction before we're done. And you're attacking? Yeah, yeah. I do not recommend attacks. Especially right now. There you go. Guard these areas. Mm, they're gonna. Clifton is defending. He's level 6. Walter Kruger. It's weird when the Chinese. The Republic of China, the left. kind of left wing Republic of China, is helping out the American Union state. Kind of odd. And I'm not, I, I still want to do this stuff, but it's not as important, I think, right now as getting just tanks. Researching these tanks. As long as you get a good number of tanks going, you don't really need to change them too much. Cool. You won. Actually, it might be better if you just helped out and attacked over here. But Russia came back to help out. That's always nice. Good job, Russia. Think, thinking of the smaller people here. Ah, restore sovereignty. Awesome. Next up, neutralize them. Ah, uh, well, I could do that. I could... Re Get the fatal legation city. Send ultimatum. The concessions to the Europeans. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Let's use the Republican capital. That sounds like fun. So the nationalist government is secure enough that we now need to put down more permanent infrastructural routes. The first step is to declare one of our politically prominent cities as a new Republican capital. The most favored location by the KMT's membership is Nanjing, but Wu Chang and Beijing also have their merits and supporters. Absolutely. Good, good, good. Help me kill off enemies here in Spain. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, they're attacking me with three divisions. How, how much manpower do they have? Let's go. They're on all adult serve. You have none as well. And then you guys are just dying. Yeah, the Carlos are dead. Kind of dead like the American Union state. Just waiting to die. Offer... <clears throat> Ugh. 
If I didn't let Mongolia live, why would I let Tibet live? That makes no sense. But now we've lost 400 people, 400 million people who are non-core population. And you must be learning a lot, Wang Yawu. Go and hold. Just hang out. Hold. Hold and hang out. Now, you're, you might lose Jackson, which is a big no-no, but whatever. Um, yeah. Oh! What? What? They lost? What do you mean, they lost? Oh, I thought they were a shoo-in. Oh, good. Look at that. Beautiful. Good. Oh, I feel good enough to help them out now. Let's go off to bed. And then call it an episode. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on. I can't get, call them just yet. I've got to wait oh, another week for this. And then as soon as I declare war, then we'll end the episode. Because then we can focus on the Japanese-controlled puppet of China, Chinese territory. Just straight up go to war with them. We are strong enough that we should be able to hold their hold our line, if not be able to push them to a degree. And this is why I need tanks. Tanks are going to be key here. There goes Somalia. 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 They were annexed. Dili province. Ah. Henan. Oh, how much population do you have here? Eh, that's not very much. Qinghai? That's not much. How much do you have here? That's not too bad. But I, I would like a little bit more when if I core some to area some some areas, so more than just the measly amounts that I than what I would get. Good, good. Yeah, I might be able to win here. You should be able to win now, Kingdom of Spain, even without my help. I do love how much XP I can get here though. Oh, they got they took over Jackson. Oh no. That's pretty bad, American Union State. You had such high hopes. Wow, look at that arm, that air XP. Nice. Oh, did we get the war goal? Good, because I don't want my soldiers to die in America. Good. Let's go to good war and let's end today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Because we took out Mongolia, we got all of this territory. The Russians are looking really evil right now. They're looking at us over our border, which I am questioning them so much. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you are new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you all tomorrow as we finish off Tibet and then reclaim Northeast China. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.